Trump. Today is January 20th, 2017. It is inauguration day. A lot of grumpy faces. To celebrate our new president, we are trying his food from Trump Grill from Trump Tower in New York City which is apparently now also Washington, D.C. There was an amazing Vanity Fair article that declares Trump Grill to perhaps be the worst restaurant in America. I know what people say about Trump. Have an open mind. Give his food a chance. I think it will tower over the rest. The taco salad, sir. Get out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is the world we live in now. Donald Trump tweeted on Cinco de Mayo last year that he loves Hispanics by eating his own restaurant's uh, take on Mexican food. Build the bowl! I used to love taco bowls in middle school. It looks like it's gonna be pretty good. White people love taco bowls. It's a deep fried salad. It's genius. It's fucking genius. Oh, hate it. I would dare to say it's not very good. This is his restaurant. This is all he eats all the time. No wonder he's so bitter and unhappy. Taco bowls were invented in America. It's like saying you love Chinese people and you eat fortune cookies. And now this is what happens to the lettuce. <laughs> you can drain it. It absorbs all the liquid and you put it on the bottom. That's why he's tweeting in the bathroom at 3 a.m. <gasps> when Trump sends his Mexican food, he's not sending his best. Let's tear this wall down. Boring. Fake Mexican. Sad. Classic. Everyone likes the burger. It's really hard to mess up a good burger, right? A Thousand Island dressing is probably how many Trump owns. Signature color of Donald Trump. We hired a billionaire because he's in touch with the working class. Say what you want about Trump, but this burger is terrible. <laughs> it's so overcooked. Oh my god, it's the driest meat. My meat is the driest meat. If you can't make a decent burger, how are you gonna be president of the United States of America? We make a lot of burgers. Just too much bread. Is this a cross-section of America? This is not the worst burger I've ever had, but I have eaten burgers off the floor. This is all I get as a tomato, and I get like one pickle? I could get a better burger at McDonald's. Imagine paying for something that you think is gonna be good, you think it's reliable, it's simple, it's classic, it gets you. I get burgers. And then you get into the burger and you're like, Oh, there's no substance to this. Oh, these fries are terrible. <laughs> are you Everything's okay? bad. Okay, Everything's so bad. This burger is as dry as Mike Pence, which means it must hate the gays. <laughs> it's overcooked, it's bland, it's boring, sad. <laughs> so 2010, a simpler time. I like rosé. I also like any alcohol. Monticello, that's ironic. Jefferson will be furious. <laughs> oh, God. Ah! Very bubbly. Things got out of control and nobody stopped me. That's just <laughs> politics. You know, it's ostentatious, but really kind of lacking. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Tiffany. You know, I kind of feel bad for Tiffany. It's got this weird orangey tinge to it. Pour some out for Hillary. <laughs> Guys, I'm in a really weird mood right now. <laughs> Tiffany is Jan Brady and Ivanka is Marsha Brady. So like, Ivanka, Ivanka, Ivanka. Let's be honest, we're gonna need to drink a lot the next four months. Years. No. Months. <sighs> Here's a salad for you to make fun of. What am I doing? What, I'm just eating food for an internet video. People are repairing a roof out there, and I just feel like a real shithead right now. So this is Ivanka's salad. There's a tendency for rich people who own restaurants to name their salads after their daughters. You're making it too easy! Wait, why is that funny? It's right there! Let's dive in. Crab cake on a Greek salad, okay? This is the class and elegance that I was expecting. I'm surprised, I mean, I feel like Greek would even be too ethnic for the Trumps. It's not bad. Let's try the crab cake. Uh, looks stringy and fake. This crab is fake. It's really fishy. It's too easy. What other jokes am I supposed to make? Right, Kelsey? It's right there. Is that what it's called? Wait, is tossing the salad the anus butt. or the vagina? The oh. It's the butt, bro. It's the butt? Well, I've tossed a lot of salads then. What am I doing with my life? Why doesn't Tiffany get a salad? <laughs> my daughter's tossed salad the best. Her crabs overrated. Not good. Problem. Sad. <laughs> Sad. <laughs> I'll be honest, steak is usually one of my favorite meals. This has to be Trump's meat line. Trump's tenderloin. 
That's a dick joke. And there's not a great sear on the outside. Where's the flavor? I think it actually is a legit quality piece of meat. No seasoning whatsoever. Why does Trump do all this stuff? He's not qualified for any of it. And I'm not lying, guys. This is all underwhelming. This must have been a lady cow. This is a mistake. <laughs> Good potatoes. Oh my god. Are the other guys enjoying these potatoes? Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Very good potatoes. Oh, a second bite of potatoes, something is off. Maybe I don't like these potatoes, but I was very sure that I liked the potatoes. I'm gonna choose that I'm not wrong. You know, I like the potatoes. I do, I, it's, it's you, you're wrong. I really thought I liked the potatoes. Oh man, he's the president now. My family came in Ellis Island, early 20th century. That's a long time ago, but when they came, they were like the assholes and the bad guys. And like, you know, 100 years before that, those people were the assholes. And like everyone that comes in, they originally, they originally are viewed as like, you know, bad because some people don't like change. But when you think about it, all of America is immigrants except for the Native Americans who we totally fucked over but no one ever wants to talk about. And I, you know, I really, I really, I don't even know how to talk about it now because I know very few Native Americans. I'm just so fucking sick of it. <laughs> <sighs> That was really bad. Donnie boy, you're bad at making food. <laughs> I'd say stick to your day job, but I don't want you to. <laughs> I did not come in here wanting the food to be bad. Having shitty food is inexcusable. Fuck you. Yo, there ain't gonna be no peaceful transition of power in my bowels tonight. Look, no matter who you voted for, we all want the same thing. We want better food. And if you give people bad food, then you shouldn't be running the restaurant. Trump has proven over the last few decades of his career that he is really good as a businessman. He's great at making deals. He's great at the facade and getting people to buy into the Trump brand. I mean, Trump Grill is an expensive restaurant in one of the most expensive parts of Manhattan, which is one of the most expensive cities in the world. And people eat there, and guess what? It's shit. There's no substance to it, and my only hope is that he puts a little more care and thoughts into his current job than he did this one. Oh, they fucking left. Here I am trying to give them champagne. Well, this is just great. My white guilt is not sufficed. I still am just sitting out here drinking fake rosé like an idiot.